After this session, the student will be able to properly set and use power management, including max output and constant ground speed, when to use, why would you use, how to set in TMC, and how it will impact the tractor's performance. To view the tractor power management screen, utilize the rotary knob to scroll up or down to select the top or bottom horizontal box. Then, press the rotary knob in one time to bring up the main menu. Utilize the rotary knob to scroll left or right to locate the power management icon and then press in on the rotary knob one time. Within the power management screen, we can now see the engine A RPM preset, the engine B RPM preset, the constant ground speed value set for the power management, as well as the decelerator RPM. To expand this view or make any adjustments, locate the icon and the hard key next to that. Press the hard key one time to expand that menu. Within the expanded menu, you can now make adjustments to any one of these four categories. Simply use the rotary knob and rotate left or right to identify the value you want to change. To adjust the value for engine speed A, press the rotary knob in one time and then use the rotary knob and scroll up or down to adjust the RPM. Once the value has been identified, press the rotary knob in one time to set and save that value. To adjust the constant ground speed setting, utilize the rotary knob and scroll down to the constant ground speed value. Press the rotary knob in one time and the value will flash. You can now adjust this setting, so scroll up or down to adjust the desired ground speed. Press in the rotary knob to save that value. Lastly, scroll over to the decelerator pedal and press the rotary knob in one time. You can now adjust the set point for the RPM. Simply scroll up or down to adjust this value. And press in the rotary knob one time to save. You can now escape out of this menu and return back to the main working screen. All of my recent adjustments have been saved and are currently displayed on the working screen.